Hey guys, it's me Derek, and uh, it's another one of those weight loss updates. I'm going to try to do one of these every other week, and that way we can kind of keep a track of where I am on the weight loss spectrum, and how much I lost, and how sexy I'll be. I probably won't be sexy, it's just a lie. That's, that's bad. I will never be sexy, but I'll be Derek. I'll still be a Derek. So you can take whatever you want from that, you know, that's... Yeah. Uh, so as of today, I'm down to 326 pounds. That is 20 pound loss from the day before was 346. My heaviest was 367, which was probably about a month ago. So yeah, we're, we're losing weight. Um, pants are starting to fall off of me that I used to wear. I can tell in my face that I'm losing weight. Maybe... I don't know. Look, I still have the chins and the chipmunk cheeks and ah, uh, yeah. But um, I'm learning a lot about myself lately, uh, especially with all the changes with what's going on with my body. It's like hitting puberty all over again, and, if, and that's kind of weird. But you know, I I'm learning that I can't eat certain things. Things that I love, I hate now. See, I love flan. I lo I'm an absolute lover of flan. If you don't know what flan is, just go to Kroger's or Walmart or something and just buy it. I won't buy it anymore because now I think it's disgusting. It's too sweet for me at this point. Um, I'm running into some problems with whenever I get up from, say, if I'm laying down or if I stand up uh, too quick, my blood pressure bottoms out. And, it's, and I almost pass out. I, you know, I literally have to grab a hold of the wall or something weird. And I went to the urgent care for that today, and they gave me some uh, dizziness meds. And they said, you know, it could be your heart. It could be this. Could be that. Um, yeah, I don't know what it is. Uh, it, it should go away. Uh, my sugar's been really well regulated. Um, I, I've not. I've been staying anywhere between 80 and 120. Um, three or four weeks ago, uh, my sugar was up to 400, almost 500. And that was bad because I wasn't taking care of myself. And I almost lost a chance of getting this surgery. Um, yeah, as far as things like, I'm on puree now. And I'm going back on clear liquids for a couple days because... I, I tried something and it didn't work. Yeah, I couldn't handle it. So everything I eat, I, I have to be really careful what I eat. Um, I'm not eating big stuff. I'm just trying things that, you know, well, maybe I can do this. Like, in fact, like seafood salad, one of my favorite things in the world, if it's made right. Yeah, so I tried that today. No, nah, fucking no. Didn't, didn't work. Uh, got pukey. It makes me sad because I love seafood salad. It's like one of my things, um, especially if it's made right. And which this case, it's not very good. I just go ahead and be honest with you. I got it from Bartram's. If you and my my town, there's a grocery store called Bartram's, and it's not Bartram's fault. I don't think maybe it's a recipe, but it sucks. Like really bad. It sucks. Um, so I, I tried that. My stomach was like no. The only thing I've been really able to keep down is cottage cheese and um, some other things. Like, I don't know. I, I, I want to try more stuff to see what I can handle, but it may be too early. It probably is too early. You know, I'm on puree. And there's not really much to choose from. Um, and that, that's where I have the weird dilemma. It's like, eh, man, I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't eat this. Maybe I should. Who knows? Then uh, I wake up and I'm feeling like ass. Uh, I'm still losing weight though, and it's a great thing. Um, I can't wait until we hit our goal weight. So maybe this time next year we'll be at my goal weight, and uh, it's anywhere between 185 and 200. I'd rather be 185 pounds. Um, 
Oh yeah, so I may have shown you guys, but yes, I got a new tattoo. It's not done yet. It will be done on the 18th. And I actually designed another tattoo, which I'm going to try to get worked on, and it's going to go on this arm. Also, yeah, yeah, it's everything's looking good. Uh, lots of detail. Pokemon, you know, Pokemon's my thing. I love Pokemon. So it makes it like the second Pokemon tattoo I have. Yeah, I'm a bit nerdy. All my tattoos are really nerdy, and all my tattoos don't make they, they make sense in the context of things because they're all nerdy but I went in with no theme whenever I got my first tattoos so all my tattoos are random random uh, pop culture video game movie stuff like that and you know you're probably wondering why, why would you get that on you I fucking like it dude I, I like it okay am I gonna like it from 40 years from now yeah I probably will I'm probably going to be a, you know, a 70-year-old nerd. Just, you know, that's how it's going to be. I'm going to be the 70-year-old nerd. And that's pretty fucking awesome, I think. Maybe, I don't know. Um, I applied for a new job. I'm hoping I get this job. It's a really good job. My last job, you know, it was all, I liked it. I got to ride around. I, I like to drive a lot, so... Um, that's a part of one of the things, especially with the new job I applied for, I'll be driving around, which I, you know, that's cool. I get to do something that's my favorite thing to do. Well, one of them anyways. And if I get it, I'll be super happy. And yeah, it'll be, it'll be my big boy job. Uh, one I can actually retire with. So, uh, if you do the prayers or the, you know, all the other stuff, feel free, uh, that would be amazing. Um, we, I hope. Uh, another thing I wanted to talk about is politics. Um, I had a few people ask me about my views on politics. I refuse to talk about my politics. I don't like to. I used to like to. But now I don't. I, I don't want to talk about it because it's literally cancer. Um, so if you guys ever want to have a video where I focus on politics, no, it's not going to happen. Um, because you can't make anybody happy. If you pick one side or the other, somebody's going to hate you. Um, uh, one thing I do hate though is a whole, uh, riot thing where people's getting their livelihoods burnt down. And, you know, that sucks. I have... You know, I have friends that live close to Kenosha, and, you know, I, I worry about them because I don't want their place to get burnt down or shot or beat up. Um, it's fucking crazy. And, you know, I hope it ends soon. I doubt it. I think it's going to get worse, especially depending on how the 2020 election goes um, on both sides. Some people say, oh, there's going to be a civil war. I don't know. Maybe. It could happen. It could happen. There could be a civil war. I don't want there to be, but it could happen. Um, everybody hates each other. Everybody hates each other. Uh, there's no respect. It's all, let's burn shit down. And there's people that's actually rioting that are just there to riot. They don't care about the calls. Or, you know, support BLM or, you know, the other side, whatever they have, Antifa. And, you know, they just join because, hey, I get to burn shit down. That's awesome. Or I get to shoot at people. That's awesome. Yeah, it's it's not awesome. It sucks. It really does. Um, so, uh, maybe next week or the week after, we'll do another video. We'll talk about how far we are. Um... I want to do a countdown to get out of the 300 club. I don't want to be 300 some pounds anymore. So once I hit um, 300 pounds under, once I maybe in the 200s, I'm I'm I'm, gonna, I'm still a thick boy. I will always be a thick boy. But once I get out of the 300s, I'm gonna be really happy, and I won't have to plan something um, for that day. Uh, I have I, I've been wanting to record some Pokemon unboxings. Um, Streamlabs has been 
fucking terrible. And I I don't know why it's been like that. Like just now, like it just almost crashed on. I, I hope it didn't crash on me. It probably did, and I'm gonna be really upset. Um But yeah, I mean I think I, there should be an update soon for Streamlabs. It's it I can barely get the cameras working whenever I hit properties to view a camera, it just completely freezes. It won't shut down unless I go through the task manager and shut it down. I don't know how widespread it is. I've looked, tried finding out information on how to fix the problem, and I've reinstalled, I've deleted the folders, deleted the cache, reinstalled after I rebooted my computer, and it still does the same thing. So I may, this video may come out right, and it looks like it will, but if I hit properties on the camera, it's gonna freeze. So that, that sucks. So I'm hoping to get some more Pokemon stuff unboxed. Um, I want to get to the point where I can do it more professionally. Because right now it kind of looks like crap. But as you know, I, I do want to open more cards. Um, I'm trying, also trying to finish up uh, Ghost of Tsushima. Um, some big games coming out. We got the uh, at new consoles coming around. Uh, we definitely... You know, I'll, I'll be picking those up. Um, yeah, we'll see. So, yeah. Um, also, if you'd be interested, I, I was thinking about going through and starting Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu, then Pokemon Shield. No, Shield. I've done Shield. I'm a sword. And go through those games through a live stream. My friend said he wants me to do a Nuzlocke. I've never done a Nuzlocke. I don't know how much I'd like it. I I'm no, I I have to catch them all, and that's the bad thing. That's why I can't do a nuzlocke because I have to catch them all. It's my nature. I have to catch them all. You fucking Pokemon. <laughs> all right. Uh, so we'll talk to you again uh, maybe next week. Um, maybe with a Pokemon unboxing. Maybe I might be able to in the next couple days do a small short unboxing of a Hidden Fates 10. I mean, it'll be a short video, but it's an unboxing. Uh, we also have some a new Japanese set coming out on the 18th. We have Champion's Path coming out later in the month. So we'll be doing a lot of that, Champion's Path. Uh, and then we have a Sashing Volt Tackle or something like that. That's, that's the Japanese version. And I think the other is called Vivid Voltage, I think. Um, I think that's what it's called. So we'll be doing, uh, most likely, a uh, booster box of each. Um, so keep that in line. Um, if you have any questions or if you want to give me a shout, feel free to message me. Um, yeah, you guys have access to my Facebook group, uh, Twitter, you name it. Just... Uh, hit that follow button, the subscribe button, whatever button you can hit. I, I would greatly appreciate it. And as always, I love you and I'll see you soon.